Hey guys, it's Justine, and today I have a brand new Sony vlogging camera that I was gonna unbox, but I already unboxed it, so um, here it is. This is the new ZV vlogging camera. Sony has been my go-to for all of my cameras. Pretty much everything that I use in my studio is all Sony. And when I used to do my daily vlogging, I would always vlog on one of the little tiny Sony vlogging cameras. This has a one inch sensor and that's way more than the average smartphone. So obviously if you are comparing phone to camera, you'll be able to get much better stills, much better low light. And with this ultra wide lens, it's fixed at a 20 millimeter wide angle lens. That for me is the ideal angle for vlogging. Audio is also something that is really important when you're making videos, and this has a built-in directional microphone. It also comes with this windscreen, so that'll help you reduce wind when you're outside, and it even has a mic jack if you want to add an external mic. It has built-in image stabilization, and the display is also touchscreen, so you're able to operate it directly from the LCD. You can also plug this into your camera to use it for live streaming or as a webcam. Another feature that I love that this has is background defocus, so this lets you get that beautiful bokeh with just the press of a button. Product Showcase is an awesome setting, especially someone who is always unboxing and showing products. When you turn on this mode, it'll quickly focus on the subject that you're showing. It has face priority auto exposure. I love this because it'll keep your subject's face in constant brightness, even if you're recording in various lighting conditions. It has a self timer countdown for video recording. I love this because sometimes I need to set myself up, get in the shot and make sure I'm actually in frame. It has a slow-mo function and a hyperlapse function. So this will allow you to shoot super smooth speeds at 5x slower or up to 60x faster. It also has a soft skin function, so when you turn this on, it'll help adjust your skin smoothness. So here's the camera. I kind of just wanted to give you a quick little overview. I just wanted to show it to you because I used to be a daily vlogger. I would vlog my entire life all the time, and it was a lot. And now, even for me when I travel, I just like taking my phone. I don't really like to bring a lot of other items. But there are some advantages that this does give to you over a phone. This is the little battery, which is similar to the RX100 and some of their previous vlogging cameras. It also has a mic input, so you'll be able to input a 3.5 millimeter microphone into that. It also has an HDMI port. The other thing that I really like about this is you can plug this in and use it as a webcam. So if you are a live streamer or you just wanna use this as a webcam to do conference calls or classes. Another thing that I like is product showcase. Now, let me just give you a little demo of product showcase. So here it is. Everything is all turned on. Okay, I'm just gonna hit record so we can give this demo. Like it'll focus so fast on the item. Oops. I like that it has the flip screen like this. So here we go, okay. Hi, it's Justine here. I'm talking about this new camera and I'm gonna show you this item. Look at that. Focus on me. Focus on item. Focus on me. Focus on item. This looks great. I'm so excited about this. So let's see what our zoom is like. Let's do all the way in. So this gives us a 1.5x zoom. Let's test out the audio. So right now I'm using my lav microphone and now we're going to switch to the microphone on the camera. And a lot of people sometimes get a little confused. They're like, why does this have a tuft of hair? Like this actually, it's so long on this one. Now here's the audio on the ZV-1F. What does it sound like? I can just press right here and do zoom, like you can automatically zoom in like super fast. I like that. So I can go directly from the wide to the one, to the 1.5. It was doing an eye autofocus, but I'm trying to show you in this top camera. Okay, look, look at that. We've got the eye autofocus, which is something that I think is very important when you're filming. I love the eye autofocus because this makes sure that your eyes are in focus. And I feel like when you're filming, that is something that you really want to capture and make sure is in focus. I can't stop looking at this because it's it looks like a person. <laughs> this also has some creative looks if you choose to add those on. I usually just do the standard because I like to add my own looks when I'm editing in post. Oh my gosh, my battery's dead. I need to charge it. Another thing that I really like is you can actually get an ND filter to put on top of this lens. And if you've never used an ND filter and you don't know what that is, just picture yourself going out on a bright day and when you put sunglasses on, everything looks much clearer. You're able to actually see. That's basically what you're doing to your camera. You're putting 
a little sunglass on top of your camera lens. And that gives the camera the ability to get much clearer, crisper images in that bright, harsh light. So that's something that I really love. My sister actually got a demo, so she has a video of this on her channel. So I'll put a link in the description if you wanna see hers. She actually shot an episode with this camera on her Sony show called The Lowdown, which is a really fun show. Her and Sydney both host it and it's so awesome. So I'm super excited to see that episode when it comes out. I'll put a link in the description to that show as well if you wanna see it. Now why I think this camera is so special is the fact that it has a 20 millimeter focal length, which is when you're holding this up, that's enough focal length to actually get yourself in the frame. And that is something that I have always struggled with because a lot of the cameras that I have, they're usually like bigger lenses and you are able to actually get your full face in frame. When I'm watching a video or when I'm filming, like I want to see the full person in frame. So right now I'm actually heading to San Diego. So I'm gonna take this and test it out and get some shots for you guys. So you can see some of the video quality, see some of the picture quality. And I really do think that this is something that is super exciting, especially for newer creators, if you've never had a camera before, this could be a good first step into that world. Do you remember how in my video I said I was going to San Diego? Well, I went to San Diego, but I didn't film anything. <laughs> now I'm in Maryland. I don't know. I am so tired right now. Like, I don't know if you can see it on my face. I feel like an absolute train wreck. I took an overnight flight. I was filming all day yesterday. Didn't sleep on the overnight flight. And now I'm here with my family. So I'm gonna vlog a little bit of this trip using the new Sony ZV, I keep, I'm so sorry, Sony. Like I keep calling it the wrong thing. <laughs> the ZV-1F. The thing that I like so much about it so far is the audio, it's very clear. I know I was making fun of the little wind wig that was on top of it, but it's working quite well. I also like that this is the 20 millimeter focal length, so I'm all in the frame. Like this is the perfect vlogging frame. Sometimes a little bit wider than this is almost too wide. This is pretty much perfect. So let's go enjoy the park. I'll show you guys Bryn, it's our niece. She has grown up quite a lot, probably since the last time you've seen her, since I don't really vlog anymore. She is such a little rascal. Hey Bryn, say hi to my camera. Hi. You're cute. Did you know that? What is it? A, a row? Woo! A row? <laughs> wow, nice Whoa. throw. Face. When I said you look like mommy, no, not that one. It was another one. It was the mad face. It was like that one. There, that's that's Brie. That's a Brie face. <laughs> that's your mommy's face. There it is. so much fun testing this out because I'm so used to making videos with large cameras and they're so heavy. So being able to just have this, it's super light and I just don't even feel like I'm holding anything. Basically feels like I'm holding my phone. I'm getting a B-roll shot here of what it looks like to hold it. I'm walking so slow that my watch has asked me if I want to end my workout. I don't. Another cool thing about this camera is it actually comes in a white version. Look at this. It's so pretty. So this is the one that Jenna has. My sister actually did a review of this as well. I'll put a link in the description if you wanna check it out, but this one looks so awesome. What do you think, Bryn? Which one do you like better? Do you like this black one or do you like the white one? Whoa, black one and the white one. Oh, you like both of them? Well, you heard it here first. She likes both of them. Anyway, I'm super excited about this camera and I'm excited to see what some other fellow content creators create with it. It's a little windy. Is there any wind? 
Is there any wind blowing? Hmm? Hmm? She's stuck. Are you stuck? No. No? Mommy can't come in. He can. He's allowed out. Let him out. He can't. Let him out. I'm gonna go back inside. It's cold out here. Come on, go inside, it's cold. Okay, well, that's it. My video's over. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. <laughs> <laughs>